Tonight, from the banks of the Brazos, a new era in Baylor basketball begins with the inaugural game in the new Paul and Alejandra Foster Pavilion, the 18th ranked Bears hosting Cornell. Toby Walter, a long three, that is no good. Back iron, Eve Misi, the rebound, puts it up and in. Eve Misi, the points that christen the new Foster Pavilion. And they move the ball exceptionally well. That's part of the reason why they shoot so great from two. Speed into Misi, he gets that one to roll over the front iron and in. Toby had a 26-point game last time out for the Bears. There's a block by Jalen Bridges. Starts the break the other way. Walter for three. In and out. Oh, and a follow by Jalen Bridges. Multiple effort plays right there, too. In 10 games, we reach the 16-minute mark. Kobe Walter drives in on the baseline right and dunks it home. Low post back outside to none. To Love for three. And it's good from the right side. Bridges back to Little for three. It's good. A th Miro Little. I mean, Miro Little doesn't get the minutes that the other two get, but when he steps on the court, he's effective and he's ready for his moment. Little again sets, fires. Another three by Miro Little. Here we go back to play. Bears up 21 14. There is Ray J. Dennis back on the floor, knocks down a three. Later, Bears take it the other way, leading 26 14. There is uh, Jacoby Walter, the runner, missed it, but tipped in his own miss. Turned out with a lucky shot. <laughs> Makes it 28-17. How about the alley-oop from A.J. Dennis to E. Meese. First half. Drive by Meese. He put the ball on the floor, and he shows out again how athletic he is as he banks it in. Okay, so along those lines as Grimes nails a long three-pointer from the left wing. Private secretive guys we've ever seen. Oh, in Baylor's campus. And they found out his girlfriend's name. Oh. Not, a, not the best shot by Jonathan Trauma Trauma. Here's lead cut to nine. There's a nice drive. Jake Nunn, tough bucket. Right into the heart of that defense. And it's home opener. And there's open lead play in Stillwater this Saturday. Mm. Nice drive by Ray J. Dennis. Toby Walter to Miro Little to Jalen Bridges. The three is good from the left corner. Closer than you might expect. There's Jaden Nunn. Has an opening and knocks down the triple. You have to finish those plays. Got to put it up. Walter Bang. does, and he hits it. Jacoby Walter, a three at the halftime buzzer. Really more so trying to outscore you. Toby Walter, first shot of the second half, and that is a three from the corner. Pass on the baseline to Jaden Nunn, back outside. Oh, another three. Oh, and another one is good by Jacoby Walter. Same spot in the left-hand corner. Ray J. Dennis gives to Bridges. Open three, straight away, knocks it down. Dennis bounces back to Walter. Walter he knocks down the three on the assist from Ray J. Dennis. Handle gets it back, step back three. Won't fall, but a put back by Eve Nisi. Our most influence when they are in Allen Fieldhouse. <laughs> I don't care what anybody says, as a player who played there, not as an analyst, but as a player who played there. 22 was the biggest lead tonight. Dennis, Ray J. Dennis, knocks down the three coming out of the timeout. Play their first game in the Foster Pavilion tomorrow night. Ooh, nice oh, give and go, and Josh O'John Luna dunks it home. Leading score tonight with 21, 16 by Eve Misi, a new career high. Jay Nunn puts three on his scoring total. The three-pointer from the left wing. Give him 10 this evening. My New Year's resolution, I, 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 <laughs> you know, I, I got to stay away, but those things are incredible. Walter spins. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. What a spinning move for the layup for Jacoby Walter. Give him 23 on the night. But what a night. The inaugural game here in Foster Pavilion goes the way of the Baylor Bears. 98-79, the final on a memorable night on the banks of the Brasses.